Hey, what's up guys? Ryan here with Tampa Carry, and today I have got the Springfield Champion 1911. I love, just like all of you, I love 1911s. They are super sexy, awesome to shoot. But Gabe here, Gabe has never shot a 1911 before. Have you ever even shot a 45? Yes. You have, okay. So you guys know, you know, nine millimeter is my personal caliber of choice. The 45 ACP, look at the difference there. Kind of reminds me of that time I took a shower with the black guy in basic training. No, no response, nothing. Yeah, I felt very bad about myself after that shower. All right, so we're gonna go shoot this gun and let's, uh, let's see what Gabe thinks. Before you shoot this Gabe, I just wanna tell you something. You know what's about to happen? You're about to fall in love. You are. This is what happens when you shoot a 1911, especially for the first time, you are gonna fall in love. Your nipples, Gabe, are instantly gonna get rock hard. What'd you think? I want one. You want one, that's the problem, man. That's the problem. All right, so Gabe likes this gun. He likes it. But we're gonna try a drill here. This is called the walk back drill, Gabe. You ready? Yeah. So the way this works is we're gonna start at the 10 yard line here. We're each gonna fire one shot at the uh, target and then we're gonna move back 10 yards only after a hit. But you only get seven rounds, okay? Okay, so one, move back. At the steel target. Okay. So now I'm gonna take it. So that's pretty easy, 10, 10 yards. So now we're gonna walk it back to the 20 yard line. Which is probably about right here. Nice. Okay, so let's come back to the 30 yard. Uh, that's probably about it right there. Okay, one round. Nope, I mean, keep going until you hit it. So you've shot four so far, so you got three rounds left. Nice. So now we're gonna walk it back to the 40. Nice. We got, he got two shots left. How many do I have? Nobody's counting? No. I think three? I have three. three. Yeah. So we're gonna try something. I normally don't do this because I don't wanna shoot over the road, but since there's two of us, he's just like, whatever. Just do whatever you want, man. So one of us will stand over there by the fence and then we'll, we can go way back here so that's even beyond the 50. So if that's 45, this is, this is probably 50. All right, so this is about the 50 yard line. We're gonna go even further back. So you have one round, is that right? One round left? Yeah. And I have two rounds left. So this is 60 yard line. Woo! Okay, that was my last shot. So now, he's got one round to try to beat me. So that was far, man. That was 60 yards. Uh, so that's called the walk back drill. So I was at a class recently, that Larry Vickers course, and we did that all the way past 100 yards. You only got eight rounds to start with. And uh, there were two dudes that actually were just cranking it every single time, 100 yards, man. Bomb, and this is a full-size steel target that I have. We were shooting the half size, which is crazy, crazy. All right, so this was his very first time shooting a 1911. What do you think about it? I loved it. Loved I'm it? Gonna get one. You're gonna buy one. So hopefully his wife is not watching because he is coming home with the gun. $1,000 he's gonna spend, or 10. Sorry, babe. Sorry, babe. Just buy her flowers, bro. That's what I always do. Or you just tell her when she sees it in the gun safe, you just say, I've owned that gun for years. You've shot that gun. I don't even, what are you even talking idea. about? Yeah. Or you just marry a mute. <laughs> She's a keeper? Yeah. Okay, cool. Because it's too expensive to ditch her now, right? Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep training and stay safe.